Hey guys, Rob from the off -grid Tiny House. Here is one of my 20, one of 20, 100 watt solar panels, polycrystalline. I know mono is better, guys. However, not better than the deal I paid for all of these. <laughs> I can guarantee that. So, <laughs> I wanted to show you something. I got angle iron here. And, um... Look at that. It's almost like it was made for it. There's a little bit, maybe an eighth of an inch on either end of that piece. And um, if you guys take a look, um, I'm going to remove that for a second. See, there's three lines here. Now under here is a 90 degree bend. I'll flip this over, show you. Okay, you got your 90 degree bend. So, first line I can't really do much with bolt wise, but the set, the second one is actually perfect. If I put my finger back here, that's exactly where the in between that one and that one will be perfect for bolting because I have enough distance away from the inner panel, which you don't even want to touch. So, when I put the angle iron on um, if you can see there's the very first line and then if I line it up so you guys can see I'm in between both lines right there and I can there's my now I have drill holes uh, drill markings and that'll be just fine now the top will be flat now I'm not using these pieces that are that I have not Guys, um, I ordered my aluminum angle iron, and it's not perforated like this, so I have to actually drill holes in to the angle iron and into the panel. But this gives you a good example of how I can do my DIY racking for these panels. And what I figure is I'm going to have two side by side, that way I get the width of the tiny house on... Um, each bolted on the racks so um, that's just to show you what's going on and uh, if you don't think I have 20 panels here's the rest of the boxes there's there's the one the other way right there two per box and I stacked them so that they're standing up um, as much as possible vertically that way they're not leaning and getting stressed and damaged other than these two which there's only two there so it's not a lot of weight but most of them are vertical so I just wanted to show you that and uh, can't wait for these guys to actually get uh, get some sun for a change <laughs> instead of sitting in boxes in my basement so <laughs> But I bought them about, what, two years ago now. Had an awesome deal. Unbelievable. Couldn't pass it up, guys. It was, it was unbelievable. And I don't care they're polycrystalline because I got 20 of them. So, and they got 30-year warranties. So, uh-huh. There you go. And uh, yeah, if you guys want to see the back, I'll show you the nameplate, the faceplate of these things made by a Canadian company um, who sell all over the world 25 years limited output guarantee um, there's all the good details for you guys that you guys want to know okay and uh, yeah really good company so it way it's been in business for a while and probably be in business for a long time because they have really good offers um and all of this was over was it ebay or amazon i think it was either amazon or ebay something like that but i had a, an amazing deal and that's where all my pwm charge controllers came from and the wiring so that all came with it as a package, so can't complain. Alright, that's it for now.